What's up everybody, Daniel here, you're watching Daniel About Tech and in this video I'm gonna show you guys the best iPhone apps. I made a video like that a few months ago but the apps are a lot better than they were and hopefully they're gonna be like this, increasing and getting better. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, uh, first I got my classic dictionary. I love this app because it uh, it works offline if you try to find a word for example like oh, any word it will work offline but if you want to hear the pronunciation of the word it will require internet connection so let me just demonstrate to you Car. as you guys can see it just pronounced so you can get with Wi-Fi or 3G I'm on 3G right now and it works so that's pretty much it Alright, next app is going to be IM Plus. This app allows you to connect with a lot of social networks like MSN and a lot more. I have actually just the MSN account, but you can get a lot. Let me just show you guys. Uh, so you hit account, edit, and add it, and we show you can get AOL, you can get MSN, Twitter, Facebook, Yahoo, Google Talk, Jabber. ICQ and MySpace, so a lot of social networks, and it is free. All right, next, of course, Twitter. If you guys don't follow me on Twitter, I'm gonna put the link in the description, so please do that. Uh, this is the official Twitter app, and it is free, which is always good. And let me just take a closer look. Here you have your mentions. You have your. Uh, Actually, I got a new mention, as you guys can see, it's blue here. Uh, you can have your uh, direct messages and search here, which will show the training topics as well. All right, the training topics. And you can find a person of, you can search for a hashtag or something like that. And here you can see your profile, or your favorites, drafts, new list, and accounts and settings. So that's pretty much it, but I really love this Twitter app and I really recommend it. Skype of course uh, you can use it like normally you can use it as a phone to call somebody if you have Skype credits or you can use it normally like MSN and stuff I, I didn't put my password and username yet but I'm gonna do that uh, it works normally. <clears throat> Next app is gonna be Flashlight this app is awesome it will turn it will, it will turn on your flash your iPhone 4 flash so let me just show you and it's really strong. You guys can't notice because you have I have a lot of light in here. But if you are in a dark room or something, it will really light up. I actually turned on on in Paramore concert that I went, and everybody just looked back and because it is really strong. All right, next we have private. This is a browser. It's really good. So if you wanna go to a site and doesn't want to save in your history, you don't have to worry because it doesn't have a history. So if you want to go to some website and you don't want anybody else to see it, this is your app. So it's just a browser, there's no need to show anything further, it's just a really simple browser. Alright, next game is going to be Cut the Rope. You can select some stages right here. Let me get the first one just to show you guys what you need to do. And in this game you basically just gotta deliver the candy in the mouth of the little monster. and try to get all the stars like that and of course it's gonna get more more and more difficult like this for example but it's pretty simple and that's pretty much what you gotta do and but it is it's a really really nice game alright uh, next sorry it's it's really fast but I have a lot of apps and uh, the time is really short uh, let's go to this little ping pong game this is gonna use your uh, motion control so let's go ahead and show you guys what you gotta do so play and you just gotta like place the the little racket underneath the ball and just gotta get it uh, uh, and, and you can't let the ball escape so and at the same time, oops, so uh, that's pretty much what you gotta do. You gotta place the racket underneath the ball and don't let it fall. 
and you're gonna get these special things and you're gonna get like two balls and stuff like that whoopsie alright I think I got it so I think you guys get it it's free by the way so you have nothing to lose so I would recommend downloading this app this little game as well alright uh, now flight control another really classic game let me go ahead and select some airfields select this pretty easy one and what you gotta do is pretty much land the airplanes so like red airplane red uh, track or field and no and you just gotta do that and you can't let them crash of course so keep doing that you're gonna get a helicopter here and this little yellow airplane right here and it's a record game so you can play it for hours and try to beat your friends records or stuff like that uh, okay okay next game is gonna be Harbor Master I actually downloaded this game first for the iPad and I really really liked it it leaks it it looks it leaks it looks a little bit like uh, uh, was an in flight control but instead of uh, airplanes you got boats so you gotta put the boats in the little thing here so it can get the cargo and when it's done you just drag it uh, outside the screen and it's pretty simple as you guys can see and you just gotta do that and keep doing that and of course it's gonna get it's gonna get way more difficult when you unlock these guys a little here but and they're gonna come a lot of little boats now I'm gonna run through a more uh, old games and then I'm gonna start going to the new games so I bomber this is a really old game as well but it's really nice so I'm just play got some mission let it load and you basically just gotta destroy the little let me just calibrate here wait a minute uh, all right so and you just gotta destroy this these little guys right here I usually like putting a lot of bombs and you just gotta destroy them it's, it's a pretty easy game but I really like it and that's pretty much what you gotta do destroying instead of getting destroyed and of course you're gonna get a lot it's gonna get a lot harder and you're gonna die after your life that is right here is over and of course you, get, you have missions sometimes you gotta destroy all the all the ships and stuff and sometimes you gotta destroy the factories and the little houses so it's a really really nice game uh, next is gonna be mini war that I mentioned so uh, let me resume here and same thing left thumb you're gonna uh, walk and right thumb you're gonna shoot let me just increase the volume a little bit alright too much okay so you gotta shoot all of the monsters and you got this score right here and this is a score game as well so you're gonna try to get a high score and when you need and when you reach 2,000 points, you're going to unlock the expert mode. And in this mode, there are going to be like a lot of more monsters and it's going to be way harder. But you're going to start with 2,000 points instead of start with 0 points. And when you reach 6,000 points, you're going to get more and more monsters and more difficulty and stuff. But your score is going to start with 6,000, so it's worth it. And that's pretty much what you got to do. You simply kill the monsters and try to beat your high score but believe me it's really worth it buying this game at least I think it's really really awesome and of course you gotta get this little loot right here and whoop, and you're gonna be a big monster and you're gonna kill everybody yeah like slaughter and right, nice 
Alright, so uh, that's pretty much mini war. Like monkey flight. This game is really cool. Girls really love this game, believe me. Uh, let's go. Uh, you have the arcade mode, which you gotta collect the fruits and try to beat your high score. And the objective is not letting it die like this, like letting it stop. You can't let it stop, so you fart when you're stopping like that. And you have two farts. And you can't let it like uh, fall in the mud or in the stone. So, and that's pretty much it. In this mode right here, start, you have your challenges, which you gotta beat your challenges. I have beaten all of them. Uh, and in this mode, like play, you're gonna have your best score like in the arcade but it will count like in today like today is zero because I haven't played it yet and best zero as, as well because I haven't played so it will mark your score in the day that you're playing alright next is gonna be the last of the old apps Rock Band this is a really nice app as well it's like music it's really like Rock Band in the PS3 or in the Wii and like Guitar Hero and stuff. So let me just so uh, let me just play a song so you guys can see. Here you have all the songs. So let's get like anything. And then you can choose your instrument like bass, guitar, drums. Since I play drums, let's get drums. All right, put easy. Should be hard, but and you just get play. So, uh, and you just you gotta play pretty easy. And that, that's it. I'm not gonna be in this game anymore. Alright, next app is gonna be Soundhound. This, li this little app up here, up here is pretty much the same, does pretty much the same thing that Shazam does, but with a little difference. It will recognize a song, uh, it will recognize a song if you sing it. And not if the the song is really played. So let me just show you guys. I'm just gonna sing. I'm gonna embarrass myself, of course. But uh, you guys can see what I do for you. So please don't laugh. All right. So I'm gonna sing Bohemian Rhapsody. I'm saying that because uh, if I don't if I don't say what I'm singing, and I can say so. See, that's the song I'm singing. But I'm I'm saying I'm gonna sing Bohemian Rhapsody, and it will appear Bohemian Rhapsody. Hopefully. So, let's go. I'm just a poor boy, nobody loves me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family. Spared to his life from his monstrosity. Easy come, easy go. Will you let me go? Bismillah. No, we will not let you go. Let me go. Alright, let's go. Um, really embarrassed right now. Alright, Bohemia Rep Zodi. As you guys can see right here. So, it really works all right next gonna be uh, doodle body this app is pretty old as well and it's just a drawing app if you wanna draw something this is pretty good uh, let me just uh, continue all right so here you can select your brushes your colors like brown or any color shock you can get a like, like a shock effect uh, extras I don't know like like bind something I don't know, uh, smudge and eraser. So this this is pretty simple, like a really simple drawing app. But if you want to draw something, this is really nice. And I'm pretty sure it's free. Like you can draw little little faces <laughs> and stuff like that. Don't forget to watch the part two of this video, which I'm gonna talk about some newer apps. I'm gonna put the link of this video in my iMac screen, so go ahead and click here. And if you wanna know how to get my wife for free, I'm gonna put the link on the MacBook Air screen right there. So go ahead and click. Click both. Here and there. Are you still here? What are you waiting for? Two videos. I'm out.